Hey guys, welcome back to another part of Let's Play, Legend of Zelda Wind Waker. And last time we began the Earth Temple, and now we're going to continue on with that. So we got Medley up here, and, uh, turn my TV down. I was eating dinner and I was watching, uh, TV while I was doing that, and I just left this on. Because I'm recording this right after the last part. So anyway, not again, not again, not again, not again, not again, not again. Oh, Jesus Christ. He actually appeared. Okay, so now we actually get to fight a floor master. Jeez. Yeah, so as you can see, basically what they do is they try to grab you and pull you into their blackness. Basically, um, they try to take you back to the beginning of the dungeon. And they're just like the wall masters and floor masters in uh, Ocarina of Time. Although these ones are definitely a little different. But that's okay. I like these, uh, floor masters but at least we don't have to deal with wall masters I'm pretty sure in this game I mean at least I don't know if you fight them in the last dungeon like the very very last dungeon I'm not sure alright so anyway now we got some light and obviously what we need to do is bring medley over here and have her work her magic with the light um, because we still have yet to get the item that lets us mess with the light as link and I'm not sure where, when we're going to get that. It probably won't be for a little bit still. But we'll get it eventually. Alright, so I know you don't have to take care of this one up here. But I'm just going to do it for, you know, my sake. Because I I swear I probably have some form of, uh... Oh, what is it? OCD? Yeah, I think it is. Like, over-compulsive disorder. Like, seriously, there's like the stupidest thing that... Things that bug me. It just, uh but anyway, so that has the pot in it, and then we... Yeah, so it looks like we're good to go from here. So let's go clear that pot, just in case. And okay, that one's already... I thought it had a uh, another uh, like wooden board thing on, uh, on top of it, but apparently it didn't. So what, what are you doing, Medley? Jeez, did she like move out the way? I wasn't even pushing the block towards her. But whatever. Okay, so I don't know what this is gonna do. Oh, it opens up the door. Okay, well then what does this one do? Maybe there's a chest in this room? I didn't think there was, but I guess there is. Yep. That might be the compass. I actually hope it, it is. Because, um... I hate not being able to see where there's chest and where there's not chests. But anyway, so it's either a chest or, or it's either the compass or something else. Yep, it's the compass. Comp. I don't know if it's comp or comp, but I always just say comp. What? Link, do not worry about straying far uh, away from Medley in the depths of the temple. Just relax and open your dungeon map. As long as you have the compass, you can easily confirm her whereabouts. Yeah, she's... Your partner's always rep represented by, uh... That little pink square on the mini-map. Or the, uh... The dungeon map, if you open that instead. Alright, so... Let's get Medley up here. You could probably actually throw her up here, but... I'm just kind of too lazy to do that. Alright. And then we'll take her through the door. And I do think we are getting close to the mini-boss. <gasps> fairies! Fairies! I'm actually gonna grab one even though I don't think I need it. But whatever. Is this okay, mommy? Alright. Set it to, yeah, yeah, I think we know how to use fairies. Actually, I don't think I've used one yet in this game. Unless I used it to, uh, refill my health. But anyway. So, oop, I saw a moblin sword. There's some moblins. Alright, hold on. Ugh. And it looks like we have another new enemy, too. But we'll have to take care of them after we take care of the moblins. Ugh, ugh. Stay away. Oh. It's not nice. Die. No, die. No, die. Oh, jeez. Stay away. Ooh. 
Hey, fucker! Yeah. Aha, uh -huh, I killed you with your own type of sword. Alright, so let's get the orb. Now, to kill these guys, these guys are Poe's. Um, basically the same kind of Poe as in, uh, that are in, um, Ocarina of Time, only these guys obviously are different. But, uh, the only way you can take care of these guys is to, um, hit them with light. And then they'll become vulnerable and you can kill them that way. But, uh, can we pick you up, Medley? Uh, apparently we can't pick her up when she's on stairs. Okay. Now let's see if we can't throw her up here. No. I'm sorry, Medley. That was poor judgment on my part. Okay, but we're gonna try it again anyway. Go! No! Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, I'll, I'm gonna get myself up here and then I'll call her. Actually, no. Probably be best to try to do this while Link is on the ground. Alright. And then we'll bring Medley up here and she can deal with the light. No. Don't hit me. Yes, fly. Okay. Oh, we can't get the Poe from here. Yes, go into the light. Uh-huh. Yeah, and then now he's all vulnerable and okay we destroyed one of those statues that's good no get the other guy yes okay no he saw me oh no 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 another thing these guys can do is that they can uh, possess you and it makes your controls all funky but luckily, it, it still counts as killing him once it wears off, so... Alright, let's go back to Medley and have her clear the rest of those statues. Do, 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 do. Alright. So... Did that one. You actually, like I said, you don't have to clear every single thing that's blocking your way. But I'm just OCD about it. And I need to clear them all. Alright, so you stay there, Medley. And then I'll take Link up there and get whatever's in this chest. I bet it's just a, a small key. Because I don't think we get, we've get we gotten to any of the treasure charts yet. And oh, just a joy pen, and I don't need those anymore. I could sell them to Beetle, but I don't think he gives you very much for those. But whatever. Um, oh, what the heck? Okay, I'm guessing I can't do anything with this either at this point. But, uh, remember that one room in the last part that I said we can't really do anything with right now? That's actually where, um, where one of the, uh, treasure charts is. But we have to wait until we get the, uh, dungeon item to do that. Alright, well that room has a key on it, so we obviously have to go through the other door. But I'm gonna go ahead and open up these skulls. So, okay. Let's venture on into this door. Ooh, excuse me, I actually forget what the mini boss is in this level. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, I think I know what's in here. And I think there's a treasure chart in here. Okay, let's do this. Ah! Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I hate these guys. I hate these guys. I hate these guys. Oh god, no! You're supposed to stay frozen! No! No! Ah! Oh god. Oh no. I'm sorry, Link. You've just been partially raped. I'm sorry. These guys are re-deads. Kind of the, uh, the scarier form of the ones from Ocarina of Time. Yeah, I'd actually see. I'd actually rather see these ones than. Well, actually, I'd rather see the ones in Ocarina of Time than these ones, because these ones are just like all skull and crazy. Oh, jeez! No, 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 no! Move, move. Okay. Okay, shoot you in the head. What? No, please! No, no, 
No. Push the controls. Uh, do something. Uh. Fire does nothing, apparently. And ice doesn't really do anything either, but arrows! Okay, I guess those are effective against them. I know there's uh, another item, I forget what it is, but there's another item that's really, like, really effective against them. No, what the heck? Oh, you've got arrows in your chest and you're still coming at me. No. Uh. Okay, die, 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 die. Okay. Jeez. But don't worry, we'll be seeing uh, plenty more of these guys to come. Okay, what's in here? Oh, key, alright. You got a small key, what a weird, what a weird kind of uh, animation for that. Alright, uh, let me just check and make sure that there is not um, a chest in here. Okay, let's see. Kill two down moblins, ghost. Um. Okay. Alright. Uh, there's not a treasure chart in here, which is good. But I just... Something was telling me that there was, but apparently there's not. No, what are you doing? Don't climb down the stairs. Doesn't that defeat the purpose of climbing up in, in the first place? Alright, so now that we have a small key, we can go through this door. And... Apparently we can't bring Medley in here, so I'm guessing that this is the mini-boss. Alright, bring it on! Yeah. Oh jeez. Another new enemy. Well, these guys aren't so bad. There's a really easy way to kill these guys. But I think we're going to end up fighting a couple of them in here. Alright, so, first off, you need you can't just kill them like they are. You actually have to get their skull to pop off and then you have to kill the skull. Well, you can attack them with your sword until they fall apart, or you can just throw a bomb at them, or two bombs to be safe. And then their skull will flop off, and then hit it with the boomerang until you can get over to it and smack it with the face in the face with the uh, the skull hammer. Um, and was the boomerang doing damage? Because it really looked like it was for a second, because of the the hero's charm. Oh, looks like we have to fight two at a time, which is not really that big a deal. Okay, come here, buddy. No. Okay. Ooh. Ah, oh, the boomerang does do damage. Let's kill him with the boomerang. Die, 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 die. No, don't come back together. I was gonna kill you with the boomerang. Okay, well that's that's something I never knew before. So I guess you can just continuously smack him with the boomerang. But no. Come here, face. Die, die. No, don't hit the fuck. Okay, the skull hammer just works so much better. Apparently. All right, come on. Fall apart. Alright, there we go. He's dead. Okay. Now it's your turn, buddy. Alright, yes. Okay, small skull hammer. I say small hammer. Jeez, alright. And once we kill that, that leads up to... <gasps> a chest! And that is the dungeon item, so let's hurry up and get that. Okay, but first I'm gonna get these orbs that are dropping rupees and arrows and all kinds of good stuff. Alright, so let's go up here. And let's see what we get. Let's see what we get. Well, this is gonna be good. I can bet this is a good one. I can't rub my hands that fast. Jeez, how does he do it? Alright, and you got the mirror shield! Its shiny surface reflects beams of light. Okay. And that's what we have to use to get out of this room. So let's do that. So, the mirror shield, its only purpose is to reflect light, as far as I know. I don't think you really use it for anything else. Well, you do use it in the final battle. Um, but more on that once we get to it. But okay. And now... There are a couple of things that we can do that we weren't able to do um, before. And oh no, come on, why do all these guys have to come back? Alright, so first off, I'm going to try to navigate Medley through this 
mess of a floor down here and see if I can't um, get her up to the platform with light. Even though we could, we could technically do it with Link now, but uh, it's better to have her up there. That way, Link can actually fight. No, fly medley, fly. Yeah, that's one of her best defenses is that she can actually fly. All right, so then. Um, it's... Can we... Oh, you know what we'll do? Come to life. Come to life. Okay, go back. Get out there. Let's do... No, don't hit me. You hit me. No. Okay, fuck, just kill these guys. Alright, oh, one of them came back. Alright. Yeah! Yeah! Oh, come on. I didn't do that much damage. That sucked. No, don't possess me. Uh, hello. At least I still killed you. So basically, when you're possessed, your controls are all inverted. So uh, it's not that big a thing, but it's still very annoying. Okay, but anyway, that, that counts as all the enemies being dead, so it's not, a, not that big a deal. Okay, so now that Medley is still kind of having her shield shine down here we can use the light that she's reflecting to open this up and that's another part with this light we can actually reflect light from medley to link and all that all right uh, I'm guessing that we want medley down here too I forgot that this was a door but uh, let's go ahead and do this and that's just a blue rupee Okay. Oh, and there's another light. Wonder what that could be. All right. Uh, medley. I'm gonna want to control you anyway. So let's get her down here. Do do. I just love singing to that music, but it's gonna be off sync when I do it. And that's why I need to break the habit of singing with the music because it always turns out um, off sync because of the way that I record. Alright, uh, we'll shine the light. And then we'll bring Link down here. And Link can reflect the light onto that door. So... Go, light! Go! Alright. And that's just, uh... Let's see... 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 80 rupees. That's not bad at all. I'll take that for the time. Alright, so let's go and open this door and then we'll see what we have awaiting for us in the next part. Oh, and that just leads us back here. Okay. Fly me there, Medley. Fly. Alright, well. Hey anyway, guys, thanks for watching. And next time on Let's Play Legends of the Wind Waker, we will continue with the Earth Temple. So see you guys next time. Bye.